So, I mean, it, it was just a lot of mental emotion that I, I that I fight with on a day to day basis. You know, you know how sometimes you're around somebody and you can just kind of feel like you're not wanted or mm-hmm. you um or you're just they they don't want to be around you for whatever reason. You can be the most positive person, upbeat person. You know, you got all your ducks in a row. Got your your life is going good, and it's just for some reason this one person just does not want to be around you. And the more I express these thoughts to other people, they're like, "Well, is your mom jealous of you?" And in my mind, I'm like, I'm "Jealous? What you gonna be jealous of me for? I don't have anything. You know, she has the house, the car, and all these different things." But it's like, no, Shayla, it's not the materialistic jealousy of that that you're talking about. It's that through all these situations, you still held a smile on your face. You have seven beautiful children. You know, you have a man that loves you and who would go to freaking jail for you. You know what I'm saying? You have all these things that life people can't pay you for. If I have to pay for happiness, I don't want it. So basically, it's like, you know what, my mom, I guess, looks at me in a way that, that despite all this mess that, I, that I've gone through, she's looking at me like, man, why don't, I have, why don't I have her joy? Why don't I have her happiness? Why don't I have her this, da, 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 and she don't have nothing, because I've been told that those very things. And to me, all I can say is, you know what, I have God. You know, that, that's the only thing that I can actually say. No matter what hell I put myself through, no matter what I have gone through, the joy, that, that, that inner peace that God gives you when you know and you solely rely on him, you know what I mean? That, that's the only thing that I can be able to say. So the rejection got so bad that I even wanted to attempt suicide because I just felt so – I wanted her validation about everything that I did. And that's actually chapter nine and a half. It's called Slice of Attempted Suicide, where I actually walked myself through the process of wanting to kill myself because of the validation of her. That 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 approval of her, uh, that that mother's love, that approval of your mom, and oh, you did a good job type of 